Hey guys, welcome back for some more Pokemon Violet. Uh, it's been a little bit. I have done some things off screen. Uh, evolved a lot of Pokemon. Uh, my Pokedex is looking uh, pretty full. <laughs> uh, there's there's not a whole lot. I've left the main team alone. Uh, this is the squad we're going to be taking to the Ghost and probably to the Psychic Gym as well. Um, probably should just give some of these guys some items. But, I mean, we got a lot of Dark and Fighting types and Normal types. Uh, but, <laughs> I have caught a few shinies <laughs> off screen. I caught these two. These, I had an extremely hard time finding them anywhere. Uh, so when I finally did find them, I just caught them because I didn't think I was going to find them anymore. And I haven't seen these anymore since I caught them. Uh, but let's take a look at the shinies. <laughs> uh, I caught this one. I went into a cave and boom, shiny bag on. <laughs> And then, out in the field, Shiny Skidoo. And then we have, of course, the Magnemite that I had before, uh, Marini, the Pseudo Wudo, and the Fortress. Uh, <laughs> oh man, the Fortress was scary. Uh, this thing could have exploded. It, it has explosion. Uh, also, very good Pokemon to train against if you have a Ghost-type Pokemon, because it can only hit you with Gyro Ball. So, as long as it doesn't hit you with that, you can get easy experience. I took a level 5 to this thing, and it didn't kill it. It blew itself up. Uh, <laughs> so, very easy way to train your Pokemon. Uh, but yeah, uh, we have these two. I might end up using them. I evolved my, uh, my Dolphin earlier, so he can do the transformation thing now. Uh, also, we have Tickatung uh, evolved off screen. And uh, we just we just been involving everybody. Uh, we did these two uh, off screen because they're walking ones, and I didn't want to bore you with that. Uh, these two with our stone evolutions. Uh, so if you want you want to take a quick look, we'll see this one eventually uh, out in the wild because I've seen them wandering around. And uh, a lot of the other ones we've we've pretty much seen. Uh, the, here's Mouse Hold. Uh, I want to get its hidden ability because I've heard this thing can be broken. <laughs> Uh, once it learns a certain move, uh, we need to evolve Toad School, and uh, yeah, that's that's pretty much been it off screen. I've been catching a whole lot of Pokemon, like an absolute crap ton, and evolving a lot more. Um, I accident. Oh, by the way, as we're walking towards the gym, I accidentally activated the the phone call for the the dragon area. I went to get this watchtower. And it activated the cutscene, and I caught a shiny not too long after it and saved. So I apologize, you won't see that. It's pretty much saying they don't know exactly where it is, but... I mean, when the map says it's here, it's probably here. <laughs> that was pretty much the conversation for that. Let's go to the gym! I have avoided walking up the stairs, thinking that it might accidentally start a cutscene. But I guess not. There's a stage. Alright, let's see what the ghost gym has in store for us. Hello, hello, Mark. How goes your treasure hunt? Figured out what you're hunting for yet? That's great, look at you, knowing exactly what you're after. Many students choose to make the gym circuit a part of their treasure hunt. It's no easy feat, but even making the attempt is a worthwhile experience. That's why I was waiting here, to make sure you know your homeroom teacher's got your back. A lucky egg! Hey, I could have used that earlier. <laughs> okay. This should be handy for your treasure hunt. I hope you'll keep working on that Pokedex of yours too, since I did make the app and all. That's all from me. Just do your best and keep out of danger. Alright. Ghost Gym. Welcome to the Montenevera Gym. <laughs> Let me register you as a challenger. Your name is Mark. Yes. Great. And now in order to face Gym Leader Rhyme, you'll first need to pass the gym test. Here at the Montenevera Gym, that means warming up the audience for the main event. That's right. You're the opening act. Opening act of what? 
Your job is to get up on the stage, show us some dead fierce Pokemon battles, and get the crowd excited before the gym leader's concert begins. You can start the gym test by speaking with MC Slit. MC Sledge. <laughs> oh my god, in front of the stage outside. Now get out there and have fun. I'm never going to get over the name MC Sledge. Good lord. So I don't... I mean, as long as they keep using ghosts, we shouldn't have much of an issue. Oh my god. Why does this dude look like... Would it be bad if I said this guy looked like Moist Critical? <laughs> Charlie, is that you? <laughs> Yo, trainer, are you the one performing the opening act today? My name's MC Sledge. This is the stage right here. So here's the deal. We're going to have you do some double battles. Oh, dear God, no. That's where you have two Pokemon fight on each side. That'll let you sledge up double the opponents and get the audience twice as excited. The venue will be hot. Uh, it'll melt the Montenegro snow. Once you get the audience worked up and ready to go, that'll be the cue for our leader to take the stage. That's how you pass our gym test, yo. Your opening act begins as soon as you get up on the stage. There'll be no backing down until you win three times in a row. Make sure you're ready. You good on the deeds for the opening act and our gym test? Good. Ready to, sled ready to sledge them up? Sweet. Just play by ear. You'll do great. Head on up on the stage. I think this is the only time I've ever done double battles in this game. Pretty sure. Oh. Warm up the audience for Ryan's concert. What's up, Montenegro? Today's opening act will be three back-to-back -back double battles by our challenger here, Mark. And the first of their three opponents will be a young performer who makes it look like a breeze. The one and only Taz. Double battles can that means one plus one, right? Can you do that? In a, yes, kid. I can do like kindergarten math. <laughs> Shut it and Grieveard. I could evolve my Grievard at any time as well, I'm pretty sure. Double battles. Love me some double battles. Well, that was simple enough. I don't think we're going to have a hard time with this gym. One plus one is two, right? Right? <laughs> yes, kid. Yes. Is this the same kid again? <laughs> the audience is cheering, got a little louder. Montenegro stage has all the latest tech. The more excited the audience gets, the more the stage will light up. Keep on sledging, you got this. Will you stop saying sludging? <laughs> and our challenger's next opponent will be a musician with a bit of a unique style. It's Lonnie. Strong compliments weak. The harmony of two Pokemon battling in unison. Alright. Let's see what you get. Haunter and Mischievous. Nut slash. One down, one to go. Well, this gym test is uh, not challenging. <laughs> that wasn't harmony. It was. <laughs> oh, jeez. Cool, the stage is lit up purple now. The audience is really getting excited. 
your opening acts turn the cheering and the stage lighting up to 11. A surprise from our new challenger who'd have thought they'd sludged up this much next is your last opponent and it's none other than me mc sludge wait did i get healed it sounded like i got healed being an mc isn't my only forte i can battle too i'll sledge you up real good in a double battle Sableye and Driftblim. Okay, Sableye is a little bit more of a challenge. Hmm. Hmm. Should just flower trick it. It's gonna get a crit no matter what. Oh, almost beat it. The drift blim's gonna be a problem if I don't get rid of it. Oh god. Ow. He just blooms. Nice move choice. He's really sledging up, MC Sledge. Should have used my nice gun. Should have my ghost type out for this. Alright. So am I Pokemon gonna get healed before the gym battle or am I gonna go in weak? That'll be interesting. It was you who sledged me up. Oh, God. <laughs> Stop with the sledging. Oh, the Pokeball looks cool in the middle. The audience's excitement has reached a fever pitch. Whoa, awesome. That was a great battle. How lucky. That was a rare sight. Thank you, Mark. Congratulations. You passed the gym test. Give him a round of applause, everybody. All right, time for the gym battle. I feel a scary good sense of unity in the crowd. Perfecto. We're ready, for, ready to go for the main event. Come on, everybody. Say it with me. This is what you've all been waiting for. Give it up for the MC of Rip Rhyme. Here's Rhyme. What's all this noise I'm hearing? <laughs> this crowd's so loud, it could wake the dead. Let me tell you what I want to hear. You feeling good? Yeah, we're feeling good. Thanks for all the, for the killer opener, baby. Now I'll get this started for real. Congrats on the gym test. That was sick, yo. Give us a minute for some rhyme time, you feel me? Go ahead and tell the lobby staffer you passed. Okay. Well, I guess I can just heal up here, I guess. I can't remember. I, I feel like one of these actually, like... I feel like they do automatically heal up your Pokemon. But just in case... We'll find out this way. Um, I'm gonna, oops, I'm gonna put you out instead of him, and I'm gonna bring you out, so we're gonna use these two, and give the other two guys a bit of a rest. Plus, it gives me a chance to use Cyclozar because I didn't really get to use him for the last gym that I wanted to use him at. Amazing job, Mark. You were a fantastic opening act. That's the gym test cleared, and well done. You've now earned the right to challenge the gym leader. Best of luck. Are you ready to challenge the gym leader, Ryan, the MC of Rip? Very well. Allow me to show you to the battle court. 
I mean, I was just out there, but <laughs> okay then. I swear to God, if Ash does this in the show and he starts rapping, I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm never going to watch the anime again if he starts rapping. <laughs> it sounds like there might be a rap battle going on over at the stage. Oh no, please God, no. I don't want a rap battle. I'm too white for this. <laughs> this is my time and this is my day. You're not going to stand in my way. Listen up, Ryan. Your reign ends here. You're going to get rung up by this pro cashier. <laughs> pro cashier. Oh, cashier, well, I'm about to check out. Must have got your rhymes on deep discount. Please, you think you can step to my game? Fool, I got rhyme right there in my name. I'm a specter from which there is no protector. And victory unto me you'll render when the crowd sees you're a mere pretender. You want to end my reign? Yeah, keep dreaming. Buy a book of rhymes, kid, and start reading. Done, you won. My rhyme's totally whiffed, <laughs> but I'll be back. Maybe after my next shift. Uh, hold up, where are you going? That's all you got? After my next shift, seriously, bars over jokes. Come on. This was over way too fast. Gets boring, we're in the crowd. In the crowd, no one makes me fight to keep it. Hmm? My opener's back. You here for a rap battle or a gym battle? I'm here for a gym battle. As if I even needed to ask. You were cat. Could I have actually rap battled? <laughs> oh my god. You were captivated by that show I put on, huh? I rap what's in my soul, baby. Weaving words into a symphony of poetry. Don't try it with me. You won't last one round. I'm like Sableye. My mean look will lock you down. Like that, you feel me? I'm sure. <laughs> well, let's get to it. You're a Pokemon trainer, so battle me and show me who you are. My music's not all that tops of the charts. My skills with ghost types are the best around. She's gonna use a Sable Eye, isn't she? At least you forget it. The name is Rhyme, and I'm known as the MC of Riv. Dead or alive, let's make this a vibe. Alright, is this going to be a double battle too? It is! Mimikyu! Love me some Mimikyu. We don't mess around in Montenegro. On my stage we double battle. Don't let it scare you. Well, we have to hit Mimikyu. Show us an awesome battle, rhyming you too, student kid. And there goes its disguise. Now we can really hit it. And it flinched. Oh, perfect. Please kill it in one hit. Oh, so close. That's gonna hurt, Cyclotar. Yeesh. Nice, he totally nailed that Pokemon's weakness without batting an eye. Ooh, my attack went up. And my special attack. Ooh, that's bad news for you. Hmm. Let's take you out and use you to take out Mimikyu. Oh, crap. Here? Uh, no, right now. Not the time pass. I can always relearn these things later if I really need them. Alright, you're two down. Toxicity. Oh, crap. Toxicity. 
Houndstone. I like the name. One of Ryan's Pokemon went down. Ooh, this is so exciting. One of? <laughs> Two of them? They don't do math up in the mountains? <laughs> so a poison electric type. Weird. What does this do again? Try to get rid of this thing. Terastalize. Kick back, relax, and enjoy this last trick. Turn it up for a grave rattling good time. Oh, she's gonna use it on toxicity, isn't she? Possibly. <laughs> oh, look at him grooving. <laughs> When I'm on the mic, even the dead rise up. DJ G Rave over there, sure feeling it. His name is DJ. <laughs> okay, I love that. <laughs> I should have just went for a bite on it. Oh well, I almost killed it anyway. Doesn't affect me. Oh crap. You did good, Cyclos are. Ooh. Well, it's a good thing I dodged that. Yes. Annihilate, you're doing so well. Um. Let's just bring in Ergraph to be able to do it. You're really killing it, Ryan. Wait, so if I terastalize my giraffe, is it gonna be. Is it gonna be a normal type? I can't remember. I need to look real quick. Will you stop raising your stats? It becomes just a normal type. Interesting. I'm not even gonna bother. This thing's over. Put your soul into it, Tessie. Let's bring the power. X. Oh, annihilate's dead. Oh my god, it survived. He survived. Oh my god. <laughs> that surprised me. I need to train my giraffe a little bit more. But we did it. Mm. Giving up the ghosts, not really my style. I'll let you have this one, though, baby. Great battle. Chilling and thrilling. You've got spirit, kid. You earned my gym badge, all right? And how about a VIP pass for my next show, too? Could I have actually rap battle with this person? <laughs> With six gym badges, it'll be easier to catch Pokemon of up to level 50, and they'll listen to what you have to say, too. It's only so good that I think I'm also going to let you have this. Ooh. Too bad it's over. Make your way back to my stage sometime. Maybe next time we rap battle instead. Who knows? I'm sure you've got some scary good adventures ahead. I'll be cheering for you later. Oh my god. Oh. Greetings once more, Mark. I was watching your battle with the gym leader from the sidelines, and I must say, I thought it was simply excellent. Full marks, gold star, extra credit even. Hardly had you sent out Cyclozar before you launched into your strategy. That unrelenting offense, that flurry of attacks, what an efficient way to corner the opponent. 
and what artfully trained Pokemon such a vibrant palette of moves. I do beg your pardon. I didn't mean to let my emotions run amok like that. <clears throat> In summary, I simply wanted to say that you seem to have gotten even stronger. I must admit, I am eager for you to gather all the gym badges. As a member of the Elite Four, I await the day you come to face me with great anticipation. Well, huh. but one thing. Don't let your studies fall by the wayside. Be sure to come to the Academy now and then. Yeah, I, I haven't been back to the Academy since I did that... Uh, <laughs> since I did a couple of those classes for an episode. <laughs> I was going to do them all off screen. I just forgot. <laughs> Alright. So she just... Or I guess you just talk to the receptionist, I guess, and... Alright, well, that is gonna do it for today's episode. If you guys enjoyed, leave a like, comment, share, and subscribe, and come on back, as uh, we're gonna be heading down uh, to the bottom left to do this gym. And when we complete this gym, we're gonna be heading to the desert to do this and then I believe we do the last gym after that. And then we have a Titan and two Team Star members to take on. Because I believe they're harder than what the gym is. So we'll get the gyms wrapped up. Um, look at all these. I find that I'm having an easier time just wandering the world and getting shinies than actually doing the mass outbreaks. Because every time I do them, I don't get anything anymore. I've done, like, three Dreepy ones, nothing. I've done, well, Slowpoke, I'm not even going to bother, because Slowpoke Shiny is awful. You cannot tell the difference between the two of them. It's like a slight change in the pink. <laughs> it's not worth it. If it was Slowbro, totally. Because Slowbro turns blue. It's very obvious. But yeah, we're going to be heading down here. Uh, so I need to teleport my way here. And, uh, yeah, I will catch you guys in the next episode when we hopefully take on the Psychic Gym. Until then, take care, everybody. Bye-bye.